Hey guys, it's John with Off Grid and Mobile Solar. I have a little small video I'm going to do here for, this has nothing to do with solar, but I have this little propane heater, this double, this dual bur burner propane heater, and it won't stay lit. I'm going to demonstrate. All right, so here's what happens. Got the propane turn on, and you light it, all right? So after about 15, 20 seconds, this thing will normally stay lit and it's just, it stopped doing that. And we'll just let this kind of run. And so I'm holding the, the pilot button on here and as soon as I let go, it should stay lit. It doesn't. If I let go, it turns off. So I want to show you an easy way to bypass this. And I do want to stress that what I'm going to do here, it's going to make it a little more dangerous, but you have this, this, uh, this is a knockover sensor. Basically there's a little, there's a little switch in here, a little ball that whenever, if this thing were to go over, it would release this switch and turn it off. But, so we're going to bypass that. I'm going to show you an easy way to do that. The easiest way to do this without actually modifying this is get yourself a small blade, uh, blade fuse. Okay, any automotive store is going to have these. But you just take off the little connectors and they have the little spade plugs on them. Okay, and then you can just insert the fuse. And they'll just slide right in just like that. Okay. Just like that. This way you're not cutting wires or anything like this. Okay. I just pulled that out. Just put that back in. All right. This way later on, I'm going to go ahead and pull this apart and see if I can fix this. You don't want to do this as an area that you get kids around. It's going to be animals or anything like that, or it could be dangerous. Um, in this case, I'm just going to have this in my workshop, so it'll be safe. So now, if I light it, it's going to stay on because this sensor is not locking it out. So I don't have to worry about trying to keep this thing on and warm everything up. Then if I want to turn it off, I just use this main valve, turn it off. And then I can turn it off up here too. So anyway, that's a quick, easy fix. Like I said, this does take away the safety, the knockover safety feature. So you want to be careful doing this. So do this at your own risk. Um, but if this video helps you like, subscribe, and share, don't forget we want to grow that channel. And uh, if I come up with a solution for this uh, other sensor on here, I'll share that with you too. But hopefully this helps. Thanks a lot.